Hi, it's Diane, and I don't have a junk journal today, but it's something similar. It's a smash book or scrapbook, photo album, whatever you want to call it. Uh, my niece asked me if I would make one for her to give as a gift to her one-year-old niece, her one-year-old niece. Um, and so I told her I would do it, and so I just want to show that to you today. But first I'll show you the papers that I used. The main group of papers is from this hot buy from Michaels, and it's from Craftsmith, and it's Llama Love. Sorry for the glare. So there are some cute llama images and, and some really pretty papers. And so I took the color theme from this, some pinks and uh, corally pinks and mint green. I also used some of the double-sided papers from this um, color box, Modern Millinery, because some of the papers matched the color. Not all of them, but some of them did. So I took out those and used them. And then I also used this pad, which is, I don't have the cover anymore, but it's the same as this. Uh, this is Prince Charming, and it has blues and grays, and it's by Recollections, but this one is what I used, and it's pinks and grays. And for some embellishments, I used some of these really cute star tickets that I had just received uh, from an Etsy seller called The Brown Pear, and I will link that shop below. I got a hundred of each of these colors. I think it was a hundred, whatever packs they're sold in. I think it's a hundred, and they, it was a really good price. So I have these um, used as embellishments in this book. It's bound with my Bind It All with one inch rings. I use the white ones. Her name is Elizabeth, so I made a pretty letter E with my um, cr Cricut with the storybook cartridge. This is one of the cut apart cards from the Llama Love paper. And there's the back. It's a hardcover book that I just covered with scrapbook paper. And on the inside, I covered it with this black and white polka dot. I believe that's from Modern Millinery. And this is an old Graphic 45 book plate this book belongs to. And this was made with the heavy um, cardstock, the Llama Love cardstock. And it's um, folded over so that it, it opens nicely. There's room to put all kinds of things in there. And I just created a couple of banners, or a banner with some of the scraps. Oh, another thing I used. Well, let me get it here. These I got on clearance. I think at Michael's, yeah. These were on clearance at Michael's. They're little sticky notes. They're for um, planners. So I used some of the elements from these. That's this flower right here. Okay, so this is from that Recollections Gray and Pink pad, and this is a stamp that I have that I stamped and cut out. Here's a card from the Llama Love, Llama Mama. I thought this would be great to have a picture of the little girl and her mama and a pocket to put things in, and I just decorated it with some scraps from the paper. These are all Llama Love paper. And there's a couple of those tickets. And here, can you see the llama pattern there? So cute. This is a Rolodex card that I just glued on as a pocket with a ticket and a couple of the journaling cards that I cut from the paper stack. This came out of, where did I get this from? Here. This is, I think, um, We Are Memory Keepers. I've had these for quite a long time. Okay, so here's one of the little sticky, sticky note things. Really pretty. Those colors were perfect for this book. I also included uh, four or five of the little sheet, little pages from the Beatrix Potter books. And this is from Mom, Llama Love. Just a really pretty little flower pattern there. And I used some stamps with my uh, Stampin' Up! Taken with Teal color, I think it was, ink. This is from my Cricut, and that's from my Cricut. 
This is one of the Modern Millinery pages. And then I used my um, Autumn Leaves collection of stamps that is for quotes, funny things that kids say. So I made several cards, quite a few cards with that stamp set. I made a set in this color and a set in pink and used them throughout the book. I love this page. You can see llamas peeking out everywhere. So cute. I took some of my scraps and made two angled pockets there and put another of the We Are Memory Keepers cards in there. This is one of the Recollections papers. This is just cut from a vintage children's book. Color is perfect for this paper. And these are both sticky notes from the planner set. And here I used a glassine bag and glued on one of the little flags from the sticky note set and just put in a white shipping tag with a little piece of silk ribbon and uh, floss, embroidery floss. Another Beatrix Potter page. I love this paper. This design is so pretty. It's one of the stamps. You say the craziest things. Another Rolodex card with a little scrap to decorate it. A journaling card from the paper stack and one of the journaling cards that I made. I used um, different uh, corner punches. Rounded and oh, I used this. There's a deco side and a stub side, ticket stub. So I did that and then I did uh, rounded corners on some of them. This one just has some washi tape on it. Here's a pocket I made with a Llama Love card stock and I used my envelope punch board to do that and there's just an index card inside and this is one of the tickets that the flap can tuck down in. It's also glued on as a pocket. More llamas and that one's just adorable. Here's the Llamas Andes Mountains. These are a couple of frames that I had cut with my Cricut. They were in my stash and I thought they were perfect for this journal. So they're not, I tried to glue them on so that the pictures could be slid down in, but I just, I couldn't make it work. So they'll have to just cut a picture and just glue it down in there. It'll work. This paper is so pretty. It's modern millinery again. This is a pocket I made with my Cricut quite a while ago. So I made it with double-sided paper and then it has these little thumb holes and it and you can cut the tags to fit right in there and the little tabs. Um, so when I get this in here, in here I can show you. It's really not that hard to put in and the little tabs fit right in there. So I love that envelope. I need to make more. Some washi tape and a little um, embellishment cut from the paper stack. Another card that I made. This is another vintage children's book illustration. And some more llamas. Washi tape and stickers. And this is just decorated with a scrap. Another vintage illustration. And then a scrap that I glued down as a little pocket with a little flag from the post-it notes and a couple of the cards tucked right in there. Still plenty of room for pictures. Some washi tape on here. This is not a pocket or anything that's just glued on. And then I took a vintage library pocket and decorated it with the llama paper, some scraps of that, and this little frame I cut with my Cricut, and it has a couple of grid index cards inside. 
so there it is. I think that's a really nice little smash book for a one-year-old girl for Mama to glue pictures and other um, keepsakes in it. So I hope that they really like it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.